Hey guys, um, in this video I'll be showing you how to create torrents. A lot of people are put off by creating a torrent but it's super easy and there are many advantages to do it. Um, for this tutorial I'll be using a program called NB Torrent Creator. It's pretty simple. Um, double click it. And this is the um, the program. As you can see, there's a lot of options, but you're not going to use most of them. So, right straight away, we have two buttons right at the top. One which is to select a file, and another one to select a folder. If you want to create a torrent with the content of a folder, you click the folder one. And if you want to create a torrent with a single file, you click the file one. <laughs> not much else to say. Go to the um, the file that you want to create a torrent of. I'm just using a file.rar or a raw. Um, then jump straight down to trackers. In here, you will post the tracker that um, is required for the website that you will be posting it on. If you're using a public tracker, you can post loads in here but if you're using a private tracker most of the time you put just one and you can normally find it on the upload page on that website I'm gonna leave it for blank leave it blank for now because I don't plan to upload this anywhere it's just a simple tutorial nothing's gonna happen if I leave this blank and now we jump straight down to here the uh, the pieces basically you can leave that as default auto detect but if you plan to make more than one torrent and you plan to upload them onto different private trackers it's best if you um, select 16, 32, 64 you know um, starting at 16 and going downwards as each each new tracker so an example would be I'm using 16 for what CD and then 32 for IP torrents 64 for torrent day so on so on so on and right down at the bottom if you're using this uh, torrent on a private tracker you click private torrent that is a must if you're using it on a private tracker and then you click create and save save it to a nice easy place that you will remember I'm saving it to the desktop and that's it it's done it's ready to be uploaded onto the website if you don't have this program you can download it or you can just use your torrent client to create the torrent pretty much every single torrent client can create one out there the reason why I use this though is because I use um, qubit torrent to create a torrent in uh, qubit torrent you click uh, options then create torrent and this looks familiar you click add file or add folder the um, the destination will go in here as you can see then add the trackers in here you can leave this blank again the piece size you can just leave it as auto unless you plan to cross seed this again private torrent if you're on a private uh, tracker this one also has an option to automatically add the torrent to qubit torrent after you create it then create it and save it that's pretty much it some websites will require you to download the torrent from their website 
after you have uploaded it. This is because they want to make sure that their, se their seeds and leeches are being protected on their website because that's what happens when you tick the box that says private tracker, uh, private torrent. And that's it. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out my other videos, especially the one that's uh, about cross seeding. It's uh, really useful information when dealing with uh, creating your own torrents, uploading them to private trackers. Have a good one. Stay safe.